Yeah, let's go! Wait for me to turn up volume on my TV, and there we go. Actually, let me turn it down a bit. There we go. It's good. Hello, everyone! I am Mr. Mike, and I am back for more Warrior Land Shake It! In the last episode, if we go on, we bought area map number 4, and we also beat Rocking Range, the boss Tortlebot. He was a creepy clown robot. I like saying clown like clown. Clown is a funny... That's a funny way to say the word clown. So now we have the world... We have Area 4, Jiggle Jungle. Probably the most oddly named world in this in this game. <clears throat> so let's start off with Ropey Jungle. It, this should be easy for us because it just has three missions for us. Our missions are to collect 50,000 coins, finish before the clock hits 1 minute... Fi sorry. Finish before the clock hits 1 minute 45, and possibly my least favorite type of mission in the entire game. Don't defeat any enemies. If you thought playing through levels without taking damage was hard, try going through the entire level without having to beat any enemies. It's not fun. It's probably going to be the last thing you'll try to do on your own. Ah, uh, look at this place. Look at the vibrant, lush colors. Uh, just take a just take a moment to to revel in this moment in this in this scenery because just look at all the green, all the colors. Don't want to beat a dead horse, but why don't why don't many more HD games try to look so as colorful as this? I mean, this is just so pretty. I love it. You need to see more colorful. You need to see more games with color these days, guys. Why are there so few games with color? Anyway, let's just climb up this rope. Where he seems to have a lot of trouble. He just goes. Eh, 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 eh. Uh, he's fat. It's, a, it's very hard for him to climb up ropes like this for vines. Find this. Uh, is my remote acting up? I was trying to shake that, but it wasn't doing anything. Hmm. May need to try to use it, my other remote that I have by me. Hold on a sec. Alright, I'm back. Sorry for that pause. Although, I'll cut that out for you. Yeah, I just quickly resynced another remote, which hopefully will sh should be working a little bit better. I may not have been doing too much in this recording, but I also did a little bit of my practice file playing this game, and I think the sh shaking feature in the game kind of wasn't working too well, so I had to change the remote. So hopefully this will work better. These vines move, by the way. You get Piranha Dentures. Cool. Uh, what I was going to say was, for the missions that say that tell us to not defeat any enemies, there are mi in some of those levels... Well, you're gonna have to use max fast velocity dash raiders to run fast so you can do the time missions and also try to get coins, but if I were you I'd save the don't kill any enemies mission for last so that or maybe you could do that first, because what you can do is just simply walk through the level. Don't don't use any dash raiders to, because you'll uh, most likely you'll run into enemies a lot and accidentally kill them. Which to let you know, I'm not gonna do that the third mission right here. I'm just gonna get that out of the way, so that I'll fail it. I'll do that on my own, without you having to see it. No worries, right? Right. Here's a wilted plant. Just jump on it, it doesn't do anything. It's just all wilted. Aw, oh, well here's a nice colorful red and yellow plant. I wonder what happens if I sit on it. It's all nice and friendly and- OH MY GOSH! Oh! Darn it, I wanted to actually be eaten. Let's do that again. Oh, it's such a nice, friendly, colorful one. Oh no! Help! Help! I've been eaten by a Venus Skytrap! Help me! This thing is called a Venus Skytrap. I know, I love the name. They may look nice and friendly, but if you stand on these guys for long enough, as you'll see again, they'll grow teeth all automatically, and then they'll try to eat you. It's quite scary. I'm gonna do something very evil. I'm gonna let you rest on this. Isn't that horrible? I just let him be eaten, eaten by a plant. It's a horrible fate. If you get eaten by a plant, you just simply shake the remote to try to free yourself. And if you also notice, if we let this guy open his, I mean, close his mouth, we can make ourselves a little bit of a platform. Let's get to that diamond. Got it. Just, oh, uh, before I go on to what I was going to say, here's a little bit of a puzzle. Not really much of a puzzle, but still something. This vine 
if you remember that one that was moving a little bit ago, could only move when it was planted, but we can't move this now because... Well, it's just horizontal, and we don't have enough running speed to actually get to it. I'm pretty sure that Dasherator should tip you off. By the way, if you're trying to... If you're trying to do the Don't Kill Any Enemies mission, I'd suggest if you want to try to avoid this Bandit Arrow, I'd tell you to just move him down to this lower platform and just drop him off there so that you don't accidentally run into him. But since I'm not doing that this mission, that will be completely proven null and void, whatever. I don't really know how to avoid things correctly. Before we actually go on that rope, I'm gonna go back this way so that I can get some of those coins that we found earlier. That were behind those steel blocks. Now my way. I don't care if I'm killing enemies left and right, I have to get my money! Wahahaha! Waro needs the money! Oh, crap. I did not mean to ruin my running speed. Oh well. No, no. Don't fall down the vines. Okay, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I think I was gonna say... You know, I'm gonna go... This, being, this video is being recorded as of July 18th, and... I'm gonna record as many of these videos for this Let's Play as I can before I leave to catch. Did I just say it? Well, if I didn't, then I'm saying it again. In about a week, like on Sunday from now, I'm gonna... Me and my family are gonna go on a vacation down to California to visit our, our grandparents and just to hang out down there. And I'm gonna try to get as many of these videos recorded as I can before we go there. By the way, here's how you move that vine. So yeah. I'm just going to record as much as I can and then do all the editing and releasing videos releasing videos on the internet there while I'm in California. No, don't eat me, you plant! So, uh, many, many of these videos will be behind their release date, so again, this is being recorded as of uh, July 18th. Sorry guys, I have to kill more of you. I know, it sucks. But just go with it. So yeah, that's what I'm doing with my videos. Ooh, these, watch out for, watch out for these, for these uh, purple, green spotted and red plants because they'll eat you immediately once they jump up on you. That snarl was the sound I love making when they try to eat you because whenever I see them, you grow those teeth all of a sudden. I just make these weird snarling sounds because I just love that sound. It just feels like that's what they should sound like when they're trying to eat you. By the way, here's a treasure chest. Eye of the Storm. Neat. Can I get these coins? I want to get those coins. No, I missed a coin! Please! Ah, oh, I missed it again. Do. So, that counts. Whenever I say things like that, I'm... Whenever I say, it, I missed, and then do afterwards, that counts too. Then, I'm still counting it. I have to get that coin. There we go. I have to say the phrase as many times as I can throughout this Let's Play. By the way, I said a bit, a few episodes ago that I was going to keep a tally mark while making these videos. I'm not going to do that while I'm, while I'm in the middle of recording these videos, because I want it would be better to keep track of them when I'm edi editing them. Let's see if I didn't make that jump properly. Right, now we made it jump properly, and here's our last treasure chest. Very easily hidden in this stage. We get Pied Piper's Pupil, the little mousy guy. We have to jump on these plants. Again, I love their names. They're, again, they're called Venus Guy Traps. Don't you just love that? So awesome. There's a coin bag over here. Just love the environment of this jungle. It's just so pretty. Just like the sun shining down through the trees. It just looks nice. Sorry for my little brief pause. So now we're at the Merfolk. Let's get him slash her. I don't know what gender these guys are. Should be pretty sure they're either gender. Just imagine which one they will be in. Yeah. They're probably either a boy or a girl. I don't know. Come on, Wario, go! Have to get have to try my best to get both of the time and coin missions. Run, Wario! As I've mentioned before. The best way to do the Don't Kill Any Enemies mission is instead... First off, try to do the coin and time mission separately so that you won't accident... Uh, do those separately and then another time just try... Oh, I missed. 
then just try running through the level slowly so that you don't accidentally kill any enemies. And I want to do this again because I want to get those last two missions. I have another, I have another little story that I was going to talk about, but I'm going to do that in the next level, which we'll be covering in this video as well. So powerful. You know, before I before I end this level off, I I just gotta wonder how I wonder how many videos of the series I'll get before I move no not move to California, I'm not moving there. I wonder how many videos of this series I'll make before I go on my vacation to California. Hopefully I'll be able to finish the story mode. If not then well we'll just see what I have see what I get done. Be sure to make these jumps correctly. You know, if you leave these coins, if you leave these coins up, those steel blocks up, and then try going later to get them, then you most likely will put yourself back a little bit when trying to get the time mission. Because getting time in this level is very, can come very close to failing if you don't do it right. So try to get those coins behind those steel blocks before you're escaping the level. And I always... I always wish I can get my thoughts out better when I'm making these videos. Oh well, I hope you can put up with that, as I've said many times before. And now part level 2 of Jiggle Jungle, it's Windbreak Bay. As you that level doesn't sound any watery enough, if that makes sense. Well, this is another subwarine level. So let's go into our yellow subwarine sub and just try to find our Merfolk here, so hope you enjoyed those underwater levels. They're fun, and they're a fun change of pace, and they're not as hard as other water levels. So here we go. You know, I don't know if you noticed, but I didn't notice that first, but if you notice that little pink tip that on the sub warring that's supposed to be, that's like supposed to represent Wario's nose. Oh, and by the way, our missions, our missions in the sub warring level are pretty much the same. We have to collect 30,000 coins, they're the same as in every other subwarine level. Oh, right. Collect 30,000 coins, collect 10 gold coins in a row, and don't break your subwarine. So, shouldn't be too hard, but I can't really remember where each of the treasures are located. Getting gold coins is harder in these levels because they're not as frequent. Yeah, these water levels aren't too bad. They're a nice change of pace, and, you know, I don't know about you, but... I don't seem to mind most water levels in games. Don't get me wrong, they can still be a bit... They can still be tedious to do, but... In lots of games, I've probably mentioned this before in, like, Donkey Kong 64, but... I don't really mind water levels in games, like... Most Donkey... Actually, in most platforming games, like Mario, Donkey Kong... And this game, for example... The water levels don't seem to be that tedious. By the way, our treasure was... I don't remember what that treasure was. It was, like, Lanternfish. Yeah, water levels don't seem to bug me. Unless it's, like, of course, a common example of the Water Temple from Ocarina of Time. That was frustrating, but... It's a very easy... Easy target for bad water levels in games. What are you, what are you gonna do? Try traversing this dangerous zone through mines. Try not to get blown up. Ah, there are gold coins up there. That could have helped. Oh well, we got this treasure. Em Ammonitless shell. Come on. Have to destroy the submarines because the enemy submarines give gold coins. Ow. Thank you for that. I'm going down this way so that I don't ex. Hope I didn't mess myself up with the gold coin mission. Uh, let's see. I think I want to go. Hold on a sec. My computer's acting stupid. It's. Falling asleep again? Come on, computer. Uh, please? Thank you. Oh, great, it's dropping frames. Seriously? Why does that always happen? Ugh. Hate it whenever I keep getting trapped by the land so that I can't go up and collect anything else. Uh, does this diamond wreck me up for the coin mission? I hope not. Yeah, I need to keep better track of my computer whenever before it falls asleep. More sub enemy submarines. Uh, yeah, I got two treasures. I, I wasn't pausing to check up my computer. No, 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 no. I. Okay, there should be more gold coins around. 
No, no, no. Have to get that one mission. Ow. You know, the mission says collect 10 gold coins in a row, but it seems to... But I always... Actually, what does it want? 10 big coins or what? Always seems to be contradictory to itself. Because I always seem to have to collect more than 10. Whatever. Right, let's hope I can go up this way. Because there's a stupid game. That's where the last treasure chest was. Okay, I don't get this gold coin mission. It... Let's see if I... I should get the... Should get the target coin amount. Hopefully. Let's hope I don't accidentally break my sub warring either. And let's just screw the 10 gold coins in a row. You're just gonna have to get creative with that yourself. Because I don't really know what to do for that. And here's our Murphal. Now in this... Oh, I didn't get the target coins. Ugh. Hate... Okay, now I'm getting pissed off at these water levels. They were fun at first, but they're really angering me now. So now we have more buttons to work with. Now we got one button. No, no, no. Don't hit me, you. I want to at least keep my sub warring perfectly intact. Come on, destroy it, destroy it. Alright. We fortunately made it through this level without breaking the sub warring, so we're fine. I don't really know this level very well. Because I really wanted to get those coin rewards. Oh well. My sub warring is fully intact and that's probably the best thing. You know, I'm thinking about if I want to go back and get that last treasure that I missed because I probably will. And again, I'm not sure how to get that at the coin mission. Either one of those. Wow, that stretched out a long way. Instead of going on to the next level, let's go back and... I'll just see what I can do about these gold coins, because I don't know what to do with them. It seems to be really contradictory to itself, because it says collect ten coins in a row, but it doesn't seem... It seems to want more. Or maybe I just messed myself up, I don't know. Uh, this level's kind of boring me. But, you know, I was I said I had a topic I wanted to talk about in the last level, so I think I'm going to bring it up now as, I'm on, as I make my way to the next treasure. Okay, uh... Hmm. It was about that microphone issue that I had last time. Uh, what was I going to say about it? I think I lost my exact ideas as to what I was going to say about it. It was about, like, well... In my last episode, I said that I had a new headset that was... that may have made my sound... my... sound better... you know, my audio sound better, that's what I was trying to say. I thought that my new microphone would work, but it didn't. Because it was... I don't know how good of a microphone it was, it was just another crummy headset, and... <sighs> I really... yeah. I really need a new microphone right now. I just use really bad headsets. Actually, one, I really would like to get something good. Like, I don't know if I'd want another headset or like a desktop microphone. Be Hold on, it's like the mission, what the... I don't know what the mission wants. I'm sorry if I'm just really jumbled right now. I'm just trying to find the correct word I want to say. Ignore these guys because I don't want their coins. I really want- I don't know if I want a desktop microphone, which I probably will because that will probably give me the best type of audio recording. Well, I could also get a Turtle Beach headset, but those things are so expensive. Yeah. Just forgive me for saying that I thought- just forgive me for the false advertising in my headset because 
my new audio recording because it's supposed to sound better, but it didn't. So I apologize for that. Are there any enemy submarines? There, an ed enemy submarine. Here's some more enemy submarines. Right then, our submarine is broken. Have to get these coins. I'm just mainly doing this level just so I can get the last treasure. Which I have to go up this way. Only take the middle path, because if you take the top path, you're just going to be screwed. Really need to practice this. I need to practice this level more. Wait, how is my time going? 21 minutes, that's fine. I think I'll cut once... I think I'll end this video off once I obtain this treasure, which is right now. I got the swine pearls. Sorry if my topic was really... Sorry if my talking was really off in the last bit of this video. I apologize. But just be just be glad it wasn't my original recording of this episode because I was just completely I just completely got bored with my video and I just had to stop because I was getting so bored with it. So anyway, I'm just gonna I'll finish this level off in my spare time, which will be after I end this video off. So in the next episode we're gonna go on to the next two levels of Jiggle Jungle, which is still a funny name of a world. So, thank you all for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys later. Bye.